So since the uh, Black Ops 3 beta is out, I decided it is a great time to make this video. I do not have a PS4, so I actually have to wait until it's out on the Xbox One to play a little bit of Black Ops 3. So it has been roughly 8 months since this happened and uh, in the past 8 months, believe it or not, almost every single day on my live stream, I still get asked if I'm in phase, if I left phase, if I got kicked, what happened and uh, what is the situation. So I didn't want to make a video right away after it happened, you know, I didn't want to cause any drama anywhere so I decided to wait a little bit and then after a while I was like, I think it's too late to make the video but apparently Apparently it's never too late, it, you know, better late than never. So the main three things is what happened to FaZe, what happened to Red, and what am I doing right now. Let's uh, address all three in this video. I'm going to try to make it quick because we don't want this to be a long video because that's just kind of boring. So I was in FaZe and then I wasn't. What happened? Uh, so a lot of people use this term moved into Red, but I got kicked from FaZe. That's, that's, I was in FaZe one moment. And then on the other one, I, I wasn't. I guess the plans that they had for me uh, just didn't work out, you know. No bad blood. Uh, I uh, I understood, obviously, I wasn't happy. You know, I wasn't happy. I was happy when I was in phase, and then I wasn't happy when I was not in phase. Um, I would have loved to stay on the team, obviously. Uh, it was just not possible. And, uh, you know, they moved me into this other team called Red. Uh, I like the idea of it a lot, obviously, but I didn't like the fact that, you know, I got out of phase to go into that team. Um, but I tried to see it as a second opportunity, um, you know, I, I tried to see it at my best of my abilities, have a positive mindset uh, towards it, and uh, that's that's what happened. So I believe it was one or two months uh, that I was in red, I tried to make videos, got a little bit of hate on the videos that I posted on red, that was fine. Uh, but after a while I started losing interest, I saw that, uh, you know, by doing what I was doing, I was definitely not going to get back to phase, and you know, that that was my hope at the time, so I decided to uh, live a little bit of uh, the Call of Duty thing and try to focus on my live stream, try to focus on the people that, you know, watch my live stream and uh, try to entertain them rather than try something that it's clearly not working and uh, with people that, you know, didn't support me. The community was a little bit rough. I'm not talking about the team. Everybody in the team, in all the teams that I was in, was actually like five stars. Everybody was really, really nice. There was no, like, douchebag that I encountered or something like that. That's not it. It was just the community a little bit, and I guess I guess it got to me a little bit at the end there. Uh, after I got kicked from uh, phase. Yeah, I decided to step down. I actually left Red, because since I wasn't really uh, going too much in depth with Call of Duty, I decided that I was just taking a spot for someone else. I decided to back down, leave that spot for someone else that was definitely working harder in terms of, uh, you know, working to Call of Duty content. Uh, and I decided to just, you know, other people definitely deserve that spot way more than me. And last, what am I doing right now? I'm live streaming every single day. Most of you that are watching this video probably know, some of you may not know. Um, I watch stream, uh, I live stream a bunch of games. Call of Duty is very rarely live streamed. Obviously, when Black Ops 3 comes out, I'm gonna be playing that, and even on the beta next week, I'm obviously gonna play that as well. And a lot of people have been asking me, am I gonna come back, you know, if I like Black Ops 3? I really don't know. I really don't know. It's something that I cannot answer right now until I have played the game. So I guess I'll give you an answer, at, you know, in the last couple of days of the next week uh, after I played it. See what I feel about the game, if I like it, if I'm actually decent at it or not. Because uh, not playing for the game, not playing Call of Duty for a lot of months in a row affected a little bit. Uh, I've been playing here and there Black Ops 2, you know, to get a feel of it. I'm able to get a couple of clips, but nothing insane. And uh, that's that's me right now. I hope, I hope that... Uh, Answers everybody's questions, you know, what happened to Red, what happened to FaZe. Hopefully that uh, clarifies everything, you know, got kicked from FaZe, left Red because I was just not into Call of Duty as much. And right now, just live streaming, trying to uh, get back on track with things. Um, enjoying live streaming a lot, you know, there's a lot of people there that have supported me in a crazy way. Uh, subs that just stay subbed for months and months and months. It's really, really cool to see, you know, even, even though it's no... And not like a big community like phase like holy shit it's still pretty cool to have like your own little community where almost everybody knows each other and uh, it's really really cool and if you guys want to one day stop by you're more than welcome to say hello in the chat i'll say hello to you back and hope you guys enjoyed this video my name is Macau, and i'll see you guys later let's play plan make a mess made damn nation let's play hands and speed